So hey guys, Google is working on some major upgrades and introducing new features with the Pixel 8 series. Recently, a hands-on video of the Pixel 8 Pro was leaked and it revealed a cool new feature that can detect your body temperature. And now, another leak shows the amazing power of the Google's Tensor G3 CPU which is what the Pixel 8 series will be equipped with. With the help of the Android Authority, we have able to gather some exciting details about the soon-to-be-released Google Pixel 8 series. That's not all, we also now know about the impressive Tensor G3 SoC that will drive these devices. To be honest, Tensor G2 didn't quite impress in the CPU performance department. When it first came out, its processor wasn't up to date compared to the other competitors. The only significant upgrade was the mid-cluster. It still followed the old 4 plus 2 plus 2 core pattern while other utilized 4 plus 3 plus 1 pattern with just one bigger core. So with the new Tensor G3, Google has really stepped up its game by including more advanced cores in the chip. They have completely changed the CPU section to use the latest 2022 ARM V9 core and even made changes to the core layout. So check this out, the Tensor G3 is coming with the 9 CPU cores. 4 Cortex A510, 4 Cortex A715 and a single Cortex X3. Plus they are all faster than the ones in the previous models. All of this will apparently result in way better performance, making the Tensor G3 able to keep up with the top tier SoCs of 2022. Still, it won't be as good as the chips with ARM V9.2 cores that were just announced. I am really curious to see if the Pixel 8's cooling system can handle all these big cores when they are going full blast. The move to ARM V9 also allows Google to implement new security technologies. The Pixel 8 will feature ARM's memory tagging extensions which can prevent some memory-based attacks. Other phones already support MTE in hardware but haven't enabled it in Android. The Pixel 8 bootloader looks to be the first to implement this interface. Unlike Tensor G2 which was a more minor refresh, Tensor G3 seems to be a bigger upgrade. Google is looking to become competitive in general applications processing and with CPU and GPU upgrades it's making it might just do it. So what do you think about this Google Pixel 8 Pro? Let me know in the comment section below. With that said, subscribe if you like and I will see you in the next one.